Hamilton has scored three times. Nice try. most of them innocently, are already familiar with a world their parents know nothing about, a world with its own jargon, its own morality, where the social pattern their parents thought entirely natural has been turned on its head and the girls have become the hunters, the boys the hunted. It's the world of the ravers. usually invade the dressing room in the interval between sets, begging for autographs or anything else they can get their hands on. Simon and the others in his group are unusually restrained in the way they respond. Not many other groups behave as well. But some of them, called by the others groupies, want more than Simon's autograph. They want Simon. That's me. What do you think is this lovely? And what happened? I had a drummer I can get back. That was Pitcho Tuesday, see? And snogged his order. Um, 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 dog. When you say you went with them, what do you mean? I don't know. You just snogged them in a. You stayed with the drummer of Jeff Beck for about two hours. Well, you stayed with him? Hmm. <laughs> Were you proud of doing that? Yeah. <laughs> Did you tell all your friends? Yeah. Did you tell your mother? No. <laughs> would she mind? I don't know, really. She wouldn't, but our dad would. What did you get out of it? What, what was the big thrill? Well, everybody liked him and I went with him, so, yeah. So, did you feel one up on everybody else? Yeah. Would you do that with any big pop star? Oh, no. You know, not if they good looking or anything like that. Would you with Simon? Yeah. <laughs> Just only asking. Oh, hey, lovely. No, you're here! Yeah? Yeah. What's that then? Are you? Oh, no, I'm not sure. No. Aren't you? Yeah. You're not I don't care. What? I don't care. Oh, man. Right. <laughs> yes. Yeah. 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 If, if the lead singer of this particular band tonight, Simon, just wanted to snap his hands, he could have had a majority of this crowd. Just they'd have just dropped their own boyfriends like that because he's Simon Dupree. Because they, they know him. They've seen him on television. He's on Saturday Club. They can tell all their friends that work tomorrow. I know, I, I went out with Simon, he kissed me, he looked at me, anything, you know? This is the thing with these, these kids. Where'd you live, Duck? Or we're staying in the hotel tonight, come back and come back and have a look around with us, this sort of thing, you know? And uh, they go back to the hotel and they finish up in bed with the, with, the, with the guys in the group and that's it. And about three months later, when the band's gone, I think they're in trouble. This has happened a lot. I think groups, groups can make or break a person. They hold certain people's destiny in their hands. They, they, because they are all to these people, they are everything. They worship them. They wake up in the morning, they have pictures on their, you know, they see them, they have them on the wall in their beds. They go to work and they dream about seeing them, and it's their life. Because their own jobs and things are so boring, and these people's lives are so exciting to them. I've been mixed with these kids for a long time, I'm sure this is what it is. That, that, that they are, the, the stars are so, their life is a paradise, and, and their life is so boring, they just throw themselves to get with them. <laughs> <laughs> 